Hi, my name is Veronica Rodriguez and I'm a secretary. I love my daughter Casey. She's smart, beautiful, responsible, full of energy. There's just one problem. Her boyfriend Chad. He's a complete idiot. This is Casey and this is her boyfriend Chad. They have been dating for a month and they think they're the perfect match. But her mom disagrees. That's why she's setting Casey up on two blind dates. If you think Casey has a problem with this, imagine how her boyfriend Chad will feel when he sits with her mom and they watch the dates together. At the end of the day, Casey will have to choose between her boyfriend or one of the dates her mom has chosen for her. Casey is about to experience parental control. Casey thinks she's in love with Chad. Chad's a self-righteous bleep. Chad is always checking out other girls in front of my daughter. He thinks he's so attractive. Newsflash Chad, ugly is not in style. He is so disgusting. He farts and burps in front of my daughter. I'm gonna find her a nice guy. The date Casey's mom first picked is about to arrive. So that means that Chad is about to watch his girlfriend go out with another guy while he hangs out in the living room with her mom. Well, my first pick is here. Mike, this is my lovely daughter, Casey. You ready to go? Yeah. Getting a little nervous, Chad. Getting a little old, Veronica. <laughs> So what do you feel like doing? Uh, you're supposed to take me out, right? That's what you do on these things on the show, right? So you, you want to go eat? Uh, sure. Uh, I'm in the mood for steak. Steak? I was thinking McDonald's. Oh, I forgot my wallet and my other pants. You think you can lend me some money? Sure. Do you go to school? No, uh, school for four. Okay. Yeah. You want to have a job? You want to get a job? I don't know. I might just sit home and live with my parents. So you don't go to school and nope. you just want to, you don't want to have a job? Nope. It's for fools. It's for fools. Hmm. I mean, I guess. I don't Mm -hmm. Go get changed. Okay. Push me. Are you serious? What do you like to do for fun? I like to play video games. You don't study? Ain't nobody got time for that. Oh, okay. Look at them having fun. She's pushing him on the swing. Where do you ever take her? I don't need to take her anywhere. She loves me, so I don't care. <sighs> My second choice is here. Casey. Hey, I'm Josh. I'm the second date. You ready to go? Yeah. Let's get to it. Okay, so how do you do it? I'll tell you how I do it. The first thing you should do is identify the subject of your paper. Second step you will do, you would turn your subject into a guiding question, and BAM! Final step is to answer your question with the statement. Jeez, wow, thanks. But make sure it's arguable. You must have something that will be possible to argue the opposite. Are you looking? Maybe you can learn something from this for your next girlfriend. My next girlfriend? My next girlfriend's still gonna be my girlfriend. No. Now. No, look. Look, Look how he's showing her things. He's so smart. He's so smart. I don't what? need to be smart. Yeah. And I... uh, be specific. Avoid broad, vague generalizations. Okay, I'll remember that. Finally, avoid list of answers and commit to one side of the issue. Are you finished? <laughs> yeah, I'm finished. Sorry about that. I uh, lost track of time right there. Now go back to your place. Did you like your date, honey? 
I did. It was nice. He wasn't looking at other girls. No one's better than me, right, babe? Uh. No one compares to you because he's way better. But I'm Rad Chad. More like Bad Chad. <laughs> Well, this is it, the final pick. Who will Casey choose to be her new boyfriend? Will it be her current boyfriend, who checks out other girls and who is a complete idiot? Or will it be one of the guys that the mom has chosen? I liked all my dates today, but sadly, I can only choose one of you. Mike, you've been terminated. You have no manners, and you made me pay. Like, who does that? No. Goodbye. Forget all you player haters. I don't need this. Your boy Mike is out. I can't believe she didn't choose me. I guess I'll never find someone, somebody like you. Now for my final decision. Josh, you're really smart. And thank you for helping me start my thesis. But you talk a lot. And Chad, you've really been there for me. And I really do like you. But my parents think you're an idiot, and you check out other girls when I'm with you. I choose... Josh. Yes! Yes! In your face! I knew it! My thesis generator got her! Yeah. Yes. Uh, this is awkward. Because I was going to say was. Oh. Can you please leave the room so I can be with my boyfriend? And I don't care if my parents think he's an idiot. In your face. And other girls. You broke my heart! I gave her my thesis generator. No.